so I am going to cut across Kudu village here. Kudu village is a uh, that is it. But Kudu village is yet another housing development. I think Galunia Farms it is are behind it or something could be. Wrong. Those, those of you that are familiar, if, if you are familiar with uh, a housing development, a much smaller housing development called Silverest Gardens, I think this place is modeled on on that, right? Uh, so you have the option to slowly pay off the house of your choice, I guess. So I am going to cut across Kudu village here. Kudu village is a... Uh, huh, that is it. But Kudu village is yet another housing development. I think Galunia Farms it is are behind it or something, could be wrong. What I quite like about some of these, uh, you know, housing developments that are popping up is there's usually a bit of a kind of like attention paid to you know them making sure that the place is serviced obviously and um, so you're assured that you're going to have access to um, electricity right so no need to struggle and you know lodge in your individual independent application through to Zesco because all this is done for you and uh, more importantly, the roads, right? I have no idea how important all these things are. I don't have an idea how important all these things are up until you go to a place like Minu Dwamwen or something. Uh, I pity the people that live in that area. So, this thing here. Yeah. yeah, I think I still have a bit of time. Yeah, so I believe all of this is uh, Kudu village. It takes you uh, all the way into Nali Road, so you actually get off or you get out of. Kudu Road somewhere near the Tumbi Cemetery. Uh, uh, this housing development actually shares a border with, with the cemetery, I believe. Uh, uh, unfortunately, I've forgotten the uh, Average prices for buying land uh, in Kudu village. I have to look this up or something. I'll probably type it in the description description box of this video if I don't forget. Uh, talk of uh, roads, yeah. Uh, not exactly the type of. Being serviced. I think the last time I cycled through here must have been two thousand and uh, 2008, I think I did a video uh, of Kudu village. Uh, it was way before people actually started constructing houses in here. Last time I was here, which was, uh, is it last? 
last week or the week before I noticed should be before actually I noticed uh, that quite a number of people had actually started constructing houses in here I'm not quite sure what's on my left here, but it looks like one of those restricted areas and I think it's owned by uh, Zambia Airport Cooperation or something. Yeah. Uh. <sighs> I need to have this thing fixed, yeah? Horrible stretch of road. I'm actually planning to. I'm planning to come through here with a very dear friend of mine who seems to be knowledgeable when it comes to building or constructing houses in Osaka. So I'm interested in picking his brains in regards to what his thoughts would be about this place right location and the price I guess ah. oh there you go I can literally see that there's a little bit of work being done on the road here ah, let's try not as hard as we would want them to but I'm trying nonetheless Yes, uh, yeah. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, shoot.
Oh. So you may not appreciate how bad the road is because uh, the bike I'm using today has uh, a rear shock so vibrations are not really as nasty as they would be if I was using a different bike like the Ascent for instance the road is bad that's what I'm trying to say here uh, I'm trying to battery power here here with this yellow yellow truck the yellow king Yeah, I'm alone. Yeah. Diving. It's a good thing I have leftovers from ah, last night.
not quite sure what's going on up ahead this other road here but uh, <coughs> that's the second truck I'm seeing this is that road <sighs> I think the wind goes, right? I think somebody's doing the construction next year. building here let's check out what's on the right here see what sort of progress people are making I'm also running out of battery power here but that's okay let's try and accelerate a little here beautiful Good road, progress. Look, man, no hands. Somebody just uh, cleared this lot here in preparation to start building. Probably drew inspiration from the neighbor on the right there. Yeah, I'm out. No problem. There we go. There we go. So this right there, up ahead, is the entrance, uh, entrance for the so-called Kudu Village Housing Development, right? This place I'm just from cycling through. It starts from right here. 
Well, I'm not quite sure how far it stretches on my left here. Um, what I do know though is uh, it's quite a uh, few kilometers. There we go. So it appears I was cycling through Chimpampa Road. Well, I'm not sure if you can see here. Uh, oh goodness, this looks like phase one then of Kudu village. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. Chimpampa Road. Okay. Kudu.village Kudu.village at lovetheland.co.zm Alright So I believe overlooking me here is uh, I think it should be part of uh, Mitumbi Cemetery or something Should be wrong but I think it is